Hand of Unity is a community of gamers looking forward to playing Ashes of Creation, an upcoming MMO. Some of us have seen a lot of games come and go, and they haven't always lived up to the hype. But we think that Ashes of Creation might be something special. I personally feel that Ashes of Creation is going to take us back to the golden age of MMOs, when games weren't just about pay to win, or silly labour systems, or glitches and exploits. It's all about just having a quality game to play with friends, where money won't have any impact at all. There are all sorts of people in Hand of Unity. Some are pretty old, some are young, and everybody's welcome. But we do think it's important to have experienced leadership. It is important to have experienced leadership, of course. Um, on the one hand, you have the guild members who join your guild, um, who mostly want to have somebody to look up to. So if you look up to somebody who's inexperienced and who makes a lot of mistakes, you won't have as much fun playing the game as with, ex uh, with an experienced guild leadership. If you have an experienced guild leadership, you can expect that uh, those people know how to communicate with you. They have uh, a bigger background in the genre, um, how to actually lead in the game as well. And they're pretty much um, important to keep the community together. Some of us have been playing games together for a long time now, although not always as Hand of Unity. We played Arcade as a Rorian Empire. Games we've played together include Rift, Conan Exiles, Ark, Black Desert Online, Sea of Thieves, and many more. Currently, we have members playing World of Warcraft together and a PvP clan playing games such as Overwatch. I joined Hand of Unity through the alpha testing phases of Arc Age. Um, and ever since I have been a part of the group on and off uh, before Hand of Unity actually formed, um, uh, which is pr probably a, a big reason why I joined, because the core members uh, were people I played with quite regularly in Arc Age and games uh, further on from that. Keep it up guys, we're outnumbered, we're doing good. Focus, focus target, focus target. Oh, our captain needs some music. Oh, there we go. It's fine. I'm yeah, running up the time. Just checking. <laughs> Fire and hole! Oh shit! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> run, 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 run! But the main focus of our community is Ashes of Creation, and as the Alpha and Beta phases come around, we'll probably focus even more on that. So within our community at the moment, we have over 30 people that have early access to Ashes of Creation, starting with Alpha 1, and the plan is to really test the early MMO stages together extensively and as a group. We also plan to record as much of that information as we can, which will be useful and also shape our strategies for the future. As we move closer to release, we have well over 70 people involved with the testing, and we will be passing on a lot of this information to the guild at large. We're an English language community, active at all times, but particularly in European time zones, and we welcome any potential members from any part of the world. I think the fact that we can be we can be quite welcome um, welcome towards new members and we do include them which I know from a personal point of view is quite difficult because so many of us have been together for so long like the core group of us have known each other for so long and even longer but it's the fact that we do try and include new members and don't make them feel left out and that we can all have a laugh and we are, you know, if someone's playing a game, you, you're not afraid to ask somebody, oh, I'm, can I come along and join in? We're very honest <laughs> with some things, so I, I definitely say a really good sense of humour is needed. Our goal in Ashes of Creation is to enjoy everything that the game has to offer. That means being successful in both PvP 
and PVE. Some of our members have different interests to others, but we appreciate the contribution made by all of them. When I first joined Hand of Unity, the one thing that I really, really stood out for me was how involved the members were. Um, especially the officers, I do feel like they take out their time and effort to make the Hand of Unity what it is today. Um, when I first joined, it was during um, before Bless released. And I just felt so welcome straight away. We're ambitious and we want to do well in Ashes of Creation. That means we expect dedication from our members. But we're not a hardcore guild. Most of us have jobs or families or both, and we play games to have fun. In Ashes of Creation, you're going to need both. You're going to need quite a lot of PvP and a quite a lot of PvE, because the caravans and the castle sieges and all these other sort of things that are going to be needed to hold the entire guild and the community together in-game is basically what I'm looking to get in Hand of Unity is a strong PvP front so we can protect those PvE players going out gathering all the resources for the PvP and making everything go forward. As well as looking for new members we're also interested in forming alliances with other guilds and communities or simply getting to know them better. If you want to find out more about Hand of Unity or to talk to us, check out our Gilded page, which you can find at handofunity.eu. That's handofunity, all one word, dot eu. There you can find out what we've been up to lately, find details of our Discord server, or just go ahead and apply for membership if you want to join. So if you are looking for a community that is fun, and not so hardcore and it's a mix of pvp pve then i definitely feel hand of unity is a place for you you're looking for a community that is going to stick around then this is the one for you the more we grow the more we can accomplish in the game a good member for hand of unity um most of it's common sense but um we we generally look for social um, interactive people who are, are willing to contribute to the community um, social-wise and also gaming, of course. Um, but in the end of the day, Hand of Unity is looking for people who are, are looking to have some fun, um, maybe come home from work, sit down, pop on Discord and chat shit, essentially. As long as you're, you know, a, a relatively decent player, you're a team player, you're a nice guy, you're respectful, and you enjoy a bit of banter, and you're easy to get along with, then, you know, do get in touch, because there's most certainly a place for you within the community.